morning all. So I've just been here at the Perrymount Clinic to see the fantastic Dr. Allison get my results for my menopausal blood tests. Um, but it just reminded me of a conversation I had with um, somebody last week. So I actually am a regular blood donor as well. And I was asked the question of, are you allowed to give blood or are you able to give blood um, if you're menopausal? Which I actually found you know quite quite astonishing because it's like well yeah that's just to do with me giving blood it's not about my hormone imbalance and at the end of the day it's just menopause it's just a stage of our life that us women are going to go through it's not a contagious disease so there's lots to be learned about the menopause um, and I learn every day um, what extra things that that I need to know by being a menopause ambassador um, I actually kind of sometimes think that my uh, my husband probably knows more about the menopause than uh, than a lot of women do as well so uh, I'm trying to move around so I haven't got the sun directly in my face here because it's an absolutely gorgeous day um, everywhere not just here in Sussex but anyway I just wanted to put that out there um, yeah uh, giving blood, uh, blood doning, um, as a menopausal woman makes absolutely no difference. There's lots of things that we need to learn and uh, I love going to do it in the workplace. In fact, actually when I start off in the workplace, if I ever get one of those sessions, which is perhaps when I do the managers and there's a mixed session in there, so it might be male and female, I will start my session by putting the gentleman at ease and letting them know that they won't be leaving this session having caught menopause. It isn't a contagious disease. Uh, if you want to know about more about menopause in the workplace, please do get in contact with me. I'd uh, love to come and talk to you, pick up the phone, or even come and do some sessions with you in the workplace. All right, take care. Bye for now.